Priyanka. Today we are going to solve a problem on effect of kyroscopic couple and centrifugal couple on a two wheeler when it is moving along a curved path. For the theoretical part of the formula, please refer my previous video and the link is given in the description box. Now first I will read what is the given problem. Find the angle of inclination with respect to vertical of a two wheeler negotiating a turn. Given combined mass of vehicle with its rider 250 kg. So we can say that here mass m is equal to 250 kg. Moment of inertia of engine flywheel 0.3 kg meter square. That is IE is equal to 0.3 kg meter square. Moment of inertia of each road wheel is equal to 1 kg meter square. So we can say that moment of inertia of wheel that is IW is equal to 1 kg meter square. Speed of engine flywheel 5 times that of road wheels and in the same direction. So here this speed is nothing but the angular speed. So this angular speed of engine flywheel that is omega e is equal to 5 times the road wheels that is equal omega e is equal to 5 multiplied by omega w and they are rotating in the same direction. Height of center of gravity of rider with vehicle 0.6 meter. So here h is equal to 0.6 meter. Two wheeler speed 90 km per hour. So velocity v is given 90 km per hour but we have to convert it into standard unit. That is 90 multiplied by 1000 divided by 3600. Because in one hour there are total 3600 seconds. And which is equal to 25 meter per second. Wheel radius 300 millimeter. So RW is 300 millimeter which is equal to 0.3 meter. And the radius of turn that is equal to 50 meter. So we can say that capital R is equal to 50 meter. So this was the given question. If we observe the question, we have to find out what is the angle of inclination theta when the vehicle is turning. So if we observe the diagram, suppose we will consider there are two wheels and here with engine. So these wheels are rotating in clockwise direction and at the same time it is turning to the right hand side. Then this vehicle, what is the initial position of this wheel? So this wheel that is initial position is along this vertical line. But as it is taking turn to the right hand side then this wheel is turned. So here this wheel is inclined at an angle theta and we have to find out that angle of inclination theta. So here is the diagram. So along this vertical line there is the initial position of the wheels and as it is taking turn this wheel is inclined. And this is the final position of the wheel and here is the angle theta that we have to find out. So as the wheel is rotating continuously and at the same time it is taking turn and that's why there is the gyroscopic couple or we can say effect of gyroscopic couple is applied. So if we observe what is the effect of gyroscopic couple. So this is the initial position and this is the final position. So what is the action is taking place by the wheel it is turned from this position 1 to position 2. So this is the action is taking place. So the gyroscope couple is getting applied in the opposite direction. So this is the direction of the reactive gyroscopic couple. Then again what is the effect of centrifugal force? So as this two wheeler is turning then here is the radius of curvature of the road and with center O. So the centrifugal force is acting in radially outward direction. So if we observe here, we can show here in this direction the centrifugal force is getting applied. But how we can show this centrifugal force for this wheel? So this centrifugal force will be passing through the center of gravity point G. So I will show here. That is the same because this uh, wheel is turning towards the center of this point O. That is 
towards the center of this curvature so we have to show the centrifugal force in the outward direction so i will show here so this is the direction of the centrifugal force so for this centrifugal force if we use the compass then what is the effect of this centrifugal force so we will consider this point as a center and move the compass in the direction of the force then here this centrifugal force will also give us the effect in the anti clockwise direction so this is due to centrifugal couple so we can say that for this centrifugal couple as well as the gyroscopic couple both are having the same anti clockwise direction and also there is the weight w so weight w is also acting to the center of gravity point g but in vertically downward direction so if i show here the w then for this w again we will use the compass so this is the center point and move the compass in the direction of w so it will move in the clockwise direction that is op opposite to these two direction centrifugal couple as well as gyroscopic couple so for, because of this weight w there is the balancing couple is getting developed and for this stability we have to equate the centrifugal couple plus gyroscopic couple and which is equal to balancing couple due to this weight w and for this stability that is when we equate these equations then we will get this angle theta so as we know what is the given data so we will put here what is the formula for this value so what is the gyroscopic couple so we have formula and for this formula please refer my previous video so here i will put the value directly in this formula that is v square by r into r w in the bracket 2 i w plus g i e cos of theta so in this we will put all the given values only one unknown value that is cos of theta so we will get here the answer 146 cos theta newton meter then what is the couple centri couple due to centrifugal force so mv square by r h cos theta so here is also one unknown term that is cos of theta so if we put all the values m that is 250 25 square divided by capital r that is the radius of curvature of the road that is 50 then h so h is given 0.6 then cos of theta so here 1875 cos of theta newton meter so for the stability so both this centrifugal couple and gyroscopic couple anti clockwise direction and for stability here weight w will act in clockwise direction so we have to put these values and which is equal to so what is this w w means mg and this perpendicular distance that this horizontal distance we have to take h sin theta so we have to take the for stability balancing couple is mg h sin of theta so m is known g is known h is known so when we put the value that is 250 into 9.81 into 0.6 sin of theta so here only one unknown term that is sin of theta and we have to add these two values so i will underline this 146 cos of theta plus 1875 cos of theta which is equal to this if we calculate this we will get 1471.5 sin of theta so we will get this so if we add the left hand side we will get 2021 cos of theta so if i take this cos theta to the right hand side and this 1471.5 to the left hand side then sin theta by cos theta which is equal to tan theta and tan theta is equal to 1.3734 so from that we can calculate this value of theta that is equal to 53.94 degree so for this stability for this two wheeler when it is taking turn the angle theta should be equal to 53.94 degree and this is the answer